Today, with a year having passed since our last visit, we embark on a journey to witness the remnants of the once bustling world's largest explosive base. Now left abandoned and desolate, our purpose is to delve into the heart of this forsaken place, employing the aid of our drone to capture the aftermath and reveal the untold tales concealed within its shattered walls. As we soar above the decaying infrastructure, we uncover the hidden secrets that have managed to withstand the ravages of time while simultaneously documenting the wheels of progress that are leaving their mark on this forsaken landscape. With each aerial sweep, the drone's lens takes us deeper into a realm of forgotten history, unveiling a haunting tapestry of what once was. Contrasting against the relentless forces that have caused this grand establishment to crumble. Join us in this expedition as we seek to immortalize the echoes of the past, preserving the memory of a place that holds stories still untold.
Around 1940, this location was chosen for its proximity to the Ohio River as a plentiful supply of water being essential in the powder production process. On February 5, 1941, construction began at the plant, and by May of 1941, employment at the plant had reached its height of an astonishing 28,000 people. The final cost of the plant was over $133 million, and in 1989, the U.S. Army placed the replacement value of the plant at nearly $2 billion. The Indiana Army Ammunition Plant consists of nearly 14,000 acres of abandoned military buildings, and it is believed to be the single largest abandonment in the United States. The former installation contained over 1,400 buildings and built in 42 to support the U.S. efforts in World War II, the base continued to produce through the Korean and Vietnam Wars. All of the gates and doors were closed and locked at the end of the Cold War. Prior to that point, the base had been kept on standby status, constantly and patiently waiting to produce should the war between the U.S. and the USSR had ever broken out. Overall, the base contained an astonishing 190 miles of roads, 35 miles of fence, and 84 miles of railroad track. Thank you.